hey, this is my personal stuff. You conveniently stuff. left it lying around. That doesn't mean I want you looking at it. I should have known better than to let you hire a 23-year-old shipping. She's adorable. Great body. It's not what it looks like. Oh, really? Who's the woman in the sketch pad, Stephen? Tell me you're not sleeping with her. For what it's worth, it didn't mean anything. It didn't mean anything. Skip the cliché. Spare me that. Fine, she was a great lady. Do you enjoy being cruel, Stephen? No, I'm sorry. Gee, I thought you would have waited just a little bit longer than to cheat on me. You want me to throw you out now? Is that what I'm supposed to do? No, I well, do I'm not going to. How do you like that? Disappointed? I know you're not attracted to me anymore. I've gotten heavier. I haven't been into sex, so it should be no surprise to me that you look for pleasure elsewhere. I know you hit on every woman that crosses your path, even in the best of circumstances. Why? Why do you do that? Dana, don't Stop you... Stop saying don't! Let's have a conversation! Why do you always hit on women? I can't help myself! Clearly! Why? Why can't you help yourself? I don't know. It's an ego thing. Yeah, and? It's maybe the only thing I feel I'm good at. Sorry, Dana, I didn't mean to hurt you. I know you, Stephen. I don't often understand you, but I know you very well. Just tell me you love me. You know I do. If the conditions are right. You feel trapped. I don't feel trapped. You feel trapped? Why can't you say these things to yourself? Give me a fucking this break. This is what I find most uncomfortable. That you have to just drag everything out of you! Fine, yes! I feel trapped! Yes, work sucks! Are we happy now? I'm going back to work. I want you to give up the graphic design business. I'll be making plenty of money. I want you making art full time. And I want you to call her up. Jesus Christ, are you I want serious? you to call her up and not to come into work tomorrow. What is this? You know what this is. If you don't do it, I will. David! It's too late, isn't it? It's too late for what? Don't play with me, David. Your mother called me an hour ago and told me that you were going to ask Melissa to marry you. Tonight! I left work early, ran eight blocks, and nearly got hit by a truck. Why didn't you tell me that you were going to propose? I was afraid you tried to talk me out of it. I didn't know you told We've been like friends this. for five years. You and me! I love you! Like a someone. So what'd she say? Well, actually, she didn't. She canceled on me. Then I'm not too late. Too late for what? For the, um, proposal planning. It's very important to plan your proposal, but you probably already knew that. Should I be taking notes? Yes. I was joking. I wasn't. <laughs> Let's start with the oh-so-casual, you-don't-realize-it's-happening proposal. Imagine this. You and Melissa are at the gym. Let's pretend that I'm Melissa. You're running. Well, run already, David! <laughs> We have cash flow. It's no big deal. Oh, okay. Uh, so, Melissa, you're really working that tummy of yours. You think I have a tummy? Well, what I meant was... I never mentioned the tummy before. Well, let's put it out. relationship she's ever had. And all she keeps talking about is all her friends are getting married. And she says it's time. It's time for me to ask her. David, are you in love with her? Well, she's not exactly my dream girl. But I'd never get my dream girl. There's something I should tell you. I never had a headache. That's a lie that they tell for me. I drink. All alone in my room, I drink. And when they want to hide it, they say, Birdie's got a headache. They don't love me. Because in 22 years, you'll be just like me. They're going to do the same thing to you. You know what? In 22 years, I've never had a day of happiness. I tell myself that if I just have one whole day, I'm going to 
be just like me. And you'll trail after them just like I do, hoping that they won't be so mean to you that day, that they won't say something that will make you feel bad. Or you'll have it worse off, because you don't have my mama. Thank you. Mm.